pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. So that's got things on the way. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Leonardo Bonucci. He's as imposing as they come, Peter. And he knows just how to use his, his physical attributes to make life difficult for attackers. He's also got a very good eye for a killer long ball. So don't be surprised if you see him launch a few counter-attacks for his team today. Yeah, the scourge of so many strikers. Dybala has a go! He scored! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Ah, oh, it's a keeper's nightmare, Peter. He just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late, having so many bodies in front of him. Juventus take the early advantage. Ferrer. Deftly done. Spezia get it back again. Luca Telli demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. Bentancourt with a definite fell there. That's great strength on the ball. Oh, that's nice. Alexandro gets it back. Bentancourt. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Ferrer. There has been just the early goal here, and the score is 1-0. He's left his man. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw, some real no-nonsense defending. Locatelli tries to dink it in, tried to play it through. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. He's Verde! And that has been clubbed away. Bonucci goes looking. Verde. Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. And it's Tibala. And here's Sandro. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well weighted. Dybala, whose goal scoring skills have already been evident. Chiesa. Rabio. Now it's Luke. And the shot! And it 
that's Morata. Locatelli. Dybala gets flagged offside. Finds himself eased off the ball. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Out to the right. That has put a stop to that. Good idea, just poorly executed. We hit half time. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front end for the half time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Juventus leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1 0 at the break. And the game has already resumed here. A solitary goal, that has been the crucial difference. It's Morata! And the defence can get it clear. Lucatelli tries to get it forward quickly. Ball through needs to be good here. Clears it out of harm's way. And it's corner. Oh, managed to get it away. Dybala. Dybala drives it forward. Now it's Morata. Got a sight of goal here. Has a pop! It's in! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe. Calm, composed, confident. What a super goal. Ah, oh, that's just clever. He made the keeper think he was going one way, only to outfox him by going the other. Very nice. Juventus have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. Just brushed off the ball there. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Oh, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Looks to thread it through. Morata has alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. The referee has given a corner. We have got changes here, from both sides in fact. That's not going far. Gets it back. This could fall anywhere. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Chiesa. Oh, well played. He needed to get that right. That's gone a long way up and away. Juventus making another change here. Oh, 
Oh, the ball's come loose. Ferrer. Ferrer huddling down that right flank. Plays it out to the flank. And it's been taken straight back. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. And now the breakaway. Big chance, must be! Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right. He couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Salah. Bastoni, Bastoni plays it forward, loses his balance and loses the ball. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Rabio, Kolachevsky, and here's Morata. Arthur, and here's Morata. Morata finds himself offside. Both sides then taking this chance to turn to their benches. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Chiesa. Gone back to the keeper. And the referee brings it to a close. Juventus come away with the win. A job really well done in all departments. A real sum of the parts team effort. Your final thoughts, Jim? Juventus simply.